As Matt Scholar here, let's talk about PHMSA's letters of interpretation. Did you know a regulated industry can submit questions to PHMSA and ask them for their opinion on any question they may have about the HMR? Recently, a state university asked a question about a remote worker who was untrained to 49 CFR. The question was, can a supervising and trained employee oversee by video the untrained employee who is performing a pre-transportation function. FIMSA responded that the untrained person may perform the shipping task when supervised by the trained employee, only when, number one, the supervising hazmat employee is able to instruct the employee's performance of the hazmat function throughout the entirety of the process. Number two, the supervising employee is able to take immediate corrective action regarding the function that may not be in, perform in conformance with 49 CFR or the hazardous material regulation. And three, the untrained employee must complete training within 90 days of performing the job function, thereby meeting 49 CFR 172.704. Read the letter yourself. Enter into your favorite search engine, FIMSA 22-0025. And remember to like and subscribe to the Hazmat Scholar. Thanks for watching.